What's up, party animals? My name is Kizzy, and today I do not feel good. And I have been putting off making this video for way too long. So, um, I wanted to instead talk about poi spinning. I wanted to bring it up because it's been something I've been doing uh, every day for the, for the, since the beginning of the month. Um, and that has been practicing poi. Now, what is poi, you may ask? Well, it's balls on a rope that you spin around. They're super awesome. And it was actually my 2020 uh, quarantine hobby. So I learned them pretty good right before I went to all the festivals and uh, even got this fursuit. Here's what they are. They glow, they have little LEDs inside of them. As you can see, it affects my face. And when you spin them, it makes pretty lights. Poi are one of my favorite things of all time. I, I love performing in them. Um, one of the things I can do is I can actually spin Poi in my full suit with my paws on, which is actually pretty hard to do. And while I can't do any of the crazy tricks like throwing it and, and whatnot, I can draw a crowd because, of course, you know, having the whole fursuit, oh, this is my Kigu, um, having the whole costume, throwing some glowing light orbs around me makes me look really mystical. So I can see why a lot of people like to see it. Now, in the spirit of uh, kind of my last video, um, I really feel like it's the end of the year and instead of doing a New Year's resolution, I'm going to get started on what I want my resolutions to be and then continue those on going into the new year so that I don't have to postpone my resolutions, but instead get into the habits and once it's the new year's, I can say, hey, I want to continue this habit because it's way easier to continue a habit than it is to make a brand new one. And one of those habits is spinning poi a little bit every single day. Um, it's, a, it's an incredible workout. I even read somewhere online it actually is good for senior citizens, which is, you know, flailing plastic balls around when you're 80 does not sound that safe. But it's a really good shoulder and joint workout as well as it's really beneficial for cardio. When I'm really getting into the zone with a song or whatever, can get my heart rate up in a very healthy way. And I think that cardio is probably one of the biggest things that a lot of people sleep on. Sure, having a big heart isn't something that you can flex like a muscle, but when you outlive every one of your friends, that might be a flex in its own right. So heart health, big thing, and poi, really good for that. Not to mention, it's a f super fun activity. You can do it anywhere. I mean, kinda. I would do it outside in my front lawn, and man, it sure would turn heads. So definitely a fun thing to do. Make sure you have the space to do it. Make sure you buy high quality poi though. That was one of the things that I struggled with at first, was I bought really, really cheap crappy poi. And the problem with that is they break easy when they're not made well and it broke and flew into someone's yard. You wanna be careful with these. Spinning them really fast and then hitting something, even with these soft ones, it can really hurt someone or themselves and you can break or, or damage them. So mine are the Podpoi V2 and they're the most popular ones out there. But if you really gotta get your spin on right away, you can get two uh, tennis balls and a pair of socks and basically just spin it in some socks and you get the exact same effect and you learn a lot, you can learn a lot of the tricks and the moves. So find some tutorials, learn some poi, uh, get your heart rate going in a healthy way. And uh, until next time, thanks so much for watching. Bye bye.